It's over. She's already happy with someone else. So, in other words, you failed to protect your queen. How could you let this happen? I did my best to convince her to stay, but she decided to be with a commoner. How foolish of her! Now, now, it's her loss. It's like she chose the mouse instead of a lion. I'm no lion. You were just blinded by love, sweetie. If I were you, I would have hanged that wretched queen. Careful, my king! Your blood pressure! I despise them! It already happened before, remember? I did warn you to not pick that pinkish devil. That family has a history of having an affair with commoners. Yet you disobeyed me. I thought she was different. An apple tree only bears apples. Her mother is a devil, so why on earth will her child be any different? Everyone makes mistakes. And it's okay. People make bad decisions, but it doesn't mean it's the end of the world. There's a lot of princesses out there. Do you want mommy to help you? There's no need for that, mom. I'm sorry for being foolish, but I already found the perfect woman for me. And she's pregnant with my heir. An heir? Oh my goodness! My queen calmed down. So, who's the woman? Isa, darling, please do not tire yourself. It will be bad for the baby. Me and your mother can handle the customers. No, I'm alright, mom and dad. I won't tire myself. Here is your frappuccino, sir. It took you five minutes to prepare my coffee? I'm sorry for keeping you waiting. You can't blame her. Besides, she's pregnant with some unknown man. She might have worked as a king's whore in the castle. I'm not a whore. Hey, bring me some dessert. I want chocolate cake. <laughs> Coming right up. One chocolate cake on table three. Okay, I'm on it. <sighs> oh gosh, new customers! Go and serve them. I will handle table tree. Okay. Check that guy out. He looks like someone important. How can you tell? Look how he dresses. He must be living in luxury. Even the guy next to him. Your Majesty. Idiot. Don't call me that. Bro? I'll kill you. Hi. Good morning. Welcome to the Lucas Cafe. My name is Isabella, and I'll be your waitress. May I take your order? We would like to order some Americano. Would you want some dessert? No, thank you. His Majesty. I mean, he doesn't like sweets. We also offer some sugar-free desserts, like our delicious blackberry cheesecake. No, we just want coffee. I don't want to anger him. Alright, preparation time is 5 to 8 minutes. If you don't mind me asking, are you two lovers? No, no we're not! Oops, my bad. I'll prepare your coffee.
and more. Here's our payment. Huh? <gasps> you disrespectful punk! My daughter is not a whore. Have some respect. Don't you have a mother or a sister? Why? It's the truth. Mom, Dad, please just ignore him. Why should we respect a whore? She didn't even respect herself when she got pregnant. She doesn't even know who the father is. I bet she slept with five or more. Disgusting. Her child will grow up without a father and will know his mother as a whore. How could she say such terrible things? Get out of her coffee shop! What the hell do you want? <gasps> what the hell is your problem? Shut your mouth! You are talking to King Baron! Huh? King Baron? Put rocks in their mouth and stitch their lips. As you command, your majesty. King Baron! Mr. and Mrs. Deloka, please forgive me for any commotions that I have caused. Please don't apologize. It's absolutely fine. That's right. We should be the ones apologizing for any inconvenience. No, sir. I love the service and your place. It's all because of our daughter. She decorated the entire place, your majesty. Isabella. What? what? Isabella, don't! It's fine. She worked with me. I am so sorry about earlier. It's fine. You don't have to worry about it. No, I thought you two were a gay couple. <laughs> Again, it's fine, Loka. I can't believe that you're here. I came to take you with me. To the castle? That's right. I'm taking you home with me. You and your parents are welcome. What? My parents were thrilled when they found out that they'll have a grandchild. How did you find out about my pregnancy? I sent someone to look after you in secret. He met he hired a stalker. <laughs> <laughs> I tried my best to keep it a secret from everyone. To avoid ruining your reputation. It's okay if you allow me to raise the child alone. Lisa, do you mean the child you're carrying is? It's mine. I'm sorry for my absence. Is she alright? She's okay, Your Excellency. She's just overwhelmed by the news. King Baron, it's really okay if I just keep it a secret. I forbid that from happening. But I'm not royalty. <laughs> I can fix that. Oh, I almost forgot. Mr. and Mrs. Deloka? I would like to ask for your permission to marry your daughter. Huh? Huh? Your Majesty, we don't want the world to think that we are gold diggers. I will do everything in my power to prevent that from happening. What about the babies? What if they grow up and find out she's not from our royal clan? I don't want them to end up like the princess from the Sakura Kingdom who was bullied in school for being half royalty. Huh? I'm sorry, you say babies? Yes, my daughter is carrying four babies. Oh, oh sh uh, excuse me, I didn't mean to. King Baron? I'm sorry, I suddenly feel unwell. Your Majesty! Uh, let me get some water for you, Your Majesty. Are you mad? Mad? Why will they be? It makes me very happy. But... No more buts. Thomas, start the van. 
as you command, your majesty. I will take good care of you. I promise. They own the helicopter. How much money did they spend on that? It's a customized helicopter, so it's about fifty million dollars. Isabella, meet my parents. Queen Suzanne and King Frederick. Welcome, Mr. and Mrs. DeLoca. So you're Isabella. My goodness, you are so beautiful. Thank you so much, Your Majesty. Amber eyes, so beautiful. Shiny dark brown hair, how lovely. Perfect teeth, white as pearls. Such beautiful features to inherit. Oh, thank you so much. Welcome. Mom, you're embarrassing me. Do shut up. I hope the baby doesn't inherit Ron Ron's baby blanket addiction. I'm certain that the baby will love bunnies and duckies. Just like how Ron Ron tried to catch one when he was still poor. Mom, stop it. I will hang you if you ever yell at me again. Bunnies and duckies? Run, run! Please feel welcome in our humble palace. If you ever feel awkward, don't hesitate to tell me. We shall drink whiskey and teacup. This will be your bedroom. If you want something, please don't hesitate to tell me. Are you craving for anything? I'm not craving anything. Come on, there must be something. I'll give you whatever you want. Hmm. I'm kind of craving for some bagel with cream cheese. Bagel with cream cheese? Alright, I'll send my best man to buy some. Thomas! <laughs> yes, your majesty? Go find the bagel with cream cheese. Find the most delicious one. I want homemade bagel and cream cheese, your majesty. Homemade cream cheese? I'm a baker, so I want to make them myself. Oh, alright then. Thomas, buy some ingredients instead. Don't buy expensive brands. Expensive brand is healthier than cheap brands. I will make sure that everything you eat is healthy and safe for our babies. Okay, your majesty. Happy birthday to you. Make a wish, granny. I wish to live long. Pill this gas that's for the baby in the Queen's Valley. Uh... I can easily put one now, Granny. If only someone allows me. <laughs> Wait, stay here. I'll get some more wine. Don't drink too much. I won't. Hi. Your Majesty. Thank you for making my sister happy. I love seeing the princess smile. It's good to know. But please, don't let her get drunk. <laughs> I won't, your majesty. This is so delicious. Set, 
drop the dumb chick and then try this. Nah, I'm not a fan of sweets. You're right. It is delicious. Told you. Oh, how sweet. Oh my god. Yeah, your grace. <laughs> this fucking weirdo. Please stand. The floor is dirty. It might ruin your pretty dress. That's what you get for watching too much Korean drama. <laughs> you must be Faye. My fiancé mentioned you to me. Yes, my queen. Long time no see, Seth. Yeah, I'm happy for you, my queen. He had a huge crush on you before. Bro, seriously? Well, not anymore. Because I already have a pretty girlfriend. Hey, hey! Cut it out! How were you able to tame someone like Seth? He was such a bully when we were still classmates. It was hard, but just like you, my queen, time and patience were the keys. That is true. But he must have bullied you, huh? <laughs> I'm the bully. For real? Serves you right, Seth. Yeah. more shots till you're satisfied until you admit that I'm prettier than you never your majesty I would like to introduce the love of my life to you wow you are gorgeous thank you your majesty Chris fragment <laughs> <laughs> I wish you really was granny Shit, what is he doing here? Damn! Is he the famous mask prince before? He is gorgeous! Hey! Good day, your majesty. I'm here to give my present to Lady Charlotte. Sure, go ahead, your majesty. Princess! Prince Baron is here. I don't care. Happy birthday, Lady Charlotte. Where have you been, little boy? I would like to give you my present. I have already prepared it in advance, but things got complicated. Thank you. Have some cake. Thanks for the offer, but I'll have to refuse. I won't be here long. How are you, your highness? I'm doing fine, your grace. By the way, congratulations. I pray for the safe delivery of your new wife. I am impressed that you already found out about it. But thank you. I must go. She's waiting for me. Farewell and have a safe trip. Run! I was not able to apologize to you, so I'm sorry for everything. I'm sorry for- I'm glad to see you healthy. Let us forget everything and move on. You good, bro? I'm watching the guy who shot my girl in the back walk away. So I'm not feeling good at all. Not one bit. Didn't I tell you to wait in the car, my sweet bagel? I just want to make sure they won't hurt you while you give Lady Charlotte's gift. Jeez, stop overthinking, Han. Besides, it will be bad for the babies. Come, let's head back home. I'm craving for my mother-in-law's <laughs> lemon tea. Thomas, start the van. All right, your majesty. 